Alright, here we go. Sit. Yeah, why not? You do not look so bad. Thank you. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Yeah, it's Big likes to that. talk, I guess. Not many could do what they did. You should be thankful. Thank you. What do you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and the Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You're thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? I've got no idea. Got no clue. Everyone was knowledgeable about the relic. A large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he get in corporal agents. You know the kind. Probably. I do possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? <laughs> mm. Sorry I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose, so... Hey, wait. I need you. Oh, come on, bro. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. Fair enough. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. Well. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. Fair Lie enough. detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Oh, well. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Oh. Prep for the heist. Thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true. He's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Interesting. What's this? What's on the telly? Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Gunpowder cook! Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? Calm you down, bro. Me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Yeah. Well, 
last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. How stupid to reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. I'll get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. Oh, well, All we'll I ask that. is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. How do you know? Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. Ooh. The Parka woman will not help you. Were I you, I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Oh, well. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. Mm. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place. The club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there. Rogue. <laughs> Take you for a suit? No, she saw me as Saburo Sama's killer. <laughs> Rogue's well informed. What is that? Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. <laughs> I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call in. Radio. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. All right. Hey. Dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. <laughs> what do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Oh, thank you. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Yeah, let's do it. Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know, Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. 
<laughs> Rogue will dance to any tune I play, or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. All right.